Hello, I'm Ederson Oliveira. I'll be presenting this video for touchhero.com and today we're going to be reviewing an app called Penultimate. Now, Penultimate is a note-taking application and if you go here, we will see its icon. See right here, this little pen. By the way, I saw this app now in a promotion on the on the store for about 99 cents. So again, great acquisition for just under a buck. But let me let me ha let's have a look here at the penultimate. So it works as a series of notebooks. And again, each notebook you can organize them as different topics, as different, uh, you know, however you want to organize them. I have a few notebooks here that I can scroll over. I'm using uh, my styles because uh, if let's just go here to one of the notebooks, I I really enjoy um, writing with the styles with uh, applications like that that you can draw. Um, but again, it will work as 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 um, well as with with your finger as with the styles. No problem with that. But uh, here, when you are taking notes, you have a few options on the left side. On the first one, you have different colors and different uh, line uh, thickness. You can have a very uh, light very thin and a, a medium one and a bit of a very thick one. To be honest, this app, uh, in terms of drawing and, and making annotations, it feels very natural. And and also, the whatever you, you do here, it feels very smooth. You see, it, it's not the lines, even if you, if you I mean, move them around. You're gonna you're gonna see that they they don't have edges. I mean, it's it's very smooth. It's very uh, very soft. You know, the whatever you do within the app, it's really really soft. The the lines are very soft and they look pretty nice. You know, and, and the and the interesting thing is that you don't have to write and then release and it will turn into a very soft line. No, not really. While you are doing it, it's already softening everything that you do here. So I'm just going to clean this in the X clean page. Uh, again, we have different colors. This is not really a drawing application or a painting application. This is more for note taking, like you're just making some arrows to point to numbers and things like that. So you can do a bunch of note taking here. Uh, again, different colors. You can use the the eraser here to erase certain things. See, even when you are erasing, you can see the edge of the line is rounded, so uh, it never gets, you know, never gets too sharp. It's always this soft uh, type of line. Um, you can cut as well. You can cut, move them around. See, again, always very, very soft the edges of anything that you draw. What else we have here? Now, let's have a look here under the icon, the paper icon. Actually, we can change this background to make it into different types of papers. Like, we have graph paper, which is the one that was preloaded here. We have line paper. We have a bunch of other types of pa papers. Plain paper without any background. We have a bunch of other types of paper that will come together with the app. Now. You also have the option to go to the paper shop and then use this um, in-app purchase. And you have, again, different types of papers. You have uh, music sheets, you have times and, and tasks, a bunch of other different types of papers that you can buy. 99 cents, as you can see here. Not going to buy them. I'm just going to hit done. 